Access geographically restricted content anywhere with ExpressVPN's home router service. Today we're going to install ExpressVPN firmware on your Linksys WRT 1200 series router. What you'll need, a Linksys WRT 1200 AC router or any compatible router listed below, a power cable, two antenna, an ethernet cable, and a computer with an ethernet port. Next we're going to screw in the antenna. Screw one in to the left and one into the right until they are hand tight. Make sure that the antenna are facing in an upward direction to achieve maximum range. We're now going to plug the ethernet cable into the back of the router. Be sure to plug it in one of the blue ports. Place the other end of the ethernet into your computer's ethernet port. Plug in your router, then toggle the power switch to the on position. Next we're going to download the firmware to flash our router. On expressvpn.com, scroll down to the router section. To the right, select the drop down and then highlight the selected router that you are going to flash. In this case, we're going to use the Linksys WRT1200AC router. Be sure this is the correct router and download the firmware to a location on your computer where you can retrieve it later. Be sure to copy your activation code to your clipboard as you'll need it later to activate your ExpressVPN router. Open your selected browser and navigate to linksysmartwifi.com. Here we're going to access the graphic user interface of the Linksys router. Click I've read and accepted the license terms and select manual configuration in the bottom left. Click the next button when you're ready to continue. Please wait. You receive a notification that you currently have no internet access and your internet connection is down. Please ignore this message and click log on. Once the sign in screen loads, type the word admin in lowercase letters under the word access router and click sign in. Now that we're logged into the router, we're going to prepare to flash it. On the bottom left under router settings, click connectivity. And we'll choose a file which is the Express VPN image that we downloaded. Select that file, hit open, allow it to load, and then click start. After clicking start, a notification message will pop up notifying you that you are attempting to flash your firmware. Proceed and select yes. Once the firmware installation is complete, you receive a message that says router rebooting. Please do not power your router off during the reboot process. Next, you'll need to navigate to expressvpnrouter.com. Here you'll be prompted to enter a password. To locate your password, look on the back of your router for the sticker. It is the eight digit number listed in the center of the sticker. Type that password into the password section under expressvpnrouter.com. Here you will notice that you are still not connected to the internet. We will connect your router to the internet in the next step and activate. In order to activate our router, we need to first connect it to the internet. Connect your ExpressVPN router from the internet port listed in yellow on the back of the router. Take the other end of the ethernet cable and plug it directly into your home modem provided by your internet service provider. Place it in one of the LAN ports identified in the picture above. Yours may be different, but similar. Next, you'll want to connect your computer to the wireless hotspot listed as your Linksys router. Connect to this Linksys router, then we'll navigate to expressvpnrouter.com. Paste the activation code that we copied earlier and press activate. Your ExpressVPN router is now activated. Router is activated. 
Feel free to select a drop down and select any geographical location from the selected VPN locations of ExpressVPN. Connect to continents in Africa, Asia, North America, and many more. Now with ExpressVPN in your home router, you have the ability to access geographically restricted content anywhere. Thanks for checking out my latest video. Make sure you subscribe to me here on YouTube and stop by and like my Facebook page to stay up to date with my latest tech tips and tricks. I'm Man Technic. I'm out for now. Peace.